Yeah, we gotta talk about this, man. We just had the baby. Um, what was it on Wednesday? You know what I'm saying? We had the baby on Wednesday, and now we got Kodak Black at a Justin Bieber after party. Man, people are unfortunately shy. One hundred, man. It's getting crazy out here. Yo, it's getting crazy out here in hip hop, man. It's getting crazy out here. Like, what's going on, man? We can't even go outside anymore. And I'm gonna tell you right now, this happens the day before the Super Bowl, but we got Kendrick Lamar, Eminem, Dr. Dre, Mary J. Blige, and Snoop Dogg performing at the Super Bowl halftime show. Pepsi. I mean, yo. This has got to be one of the most big, biggest moments in uh, in the history of hip hop, but all these fights and shootings. This is a shooting too now, and it, the one thing that is very interesting to me too is the Ferraris that I see parked in front of people getting shot. Uh, but maybe it's not that because I don't want this video to get demonetized. You know, we're just doing an observation here, so please uh, bear with the footage. You know, but it's it's just like, man, does all this have to be going on? Well, here. So, nobody's certain, like, really, like, how that fight happened. I'm a Yo, it's like, man, w w what's going on here, man? What's going on here? In a week in hip hop leading up to the Super Bowl, which is probably going to be one of the most or the biggest hip hop events that happened in the history of hip hop, I would say. How how is this happening, man? How is this happening? And I got people right here tripping on this and saying like, "Yo, man, that's why I'm about to chill." I'm gonna tell you right now: if you in Los Angeles, you need to chill right now. You know, I, I wouldn't be out there like that. I mean, I heard that Eminem, you know, he got his pop-up shop out there in downtown L.A. And Mom Spaghetti just vomiting on his sweater already. Mom Spaghetti. He's nervous, but on the surface, he's calm and ready. Man, I want to watch all these takes on this whatever happened here. Here we go, here we go. This is gonna be another America thing. This is another like they say they're gonna bring the lawyers out. Here we go, we're gonna bring the lawyers out. Are you serious? This is all before the Super Bowl. Oh, she's a nurse with her. Oh, the guy has to happen to have a Yeezy sweater on right there. Alright, alright. They're not gonna let... They're not... Yo, yo, yo. Yeah, I gotta stop that right there because I think if we show too much of that, they're not gonna let us... They're gonna demonetize this video on YouTube. And we don't want that to happen. But I gotta tell you, man, what is up in hip-hop, man? What is up? What is up, man? What is up, yo? Like this, this is just in one week leading up to the Super Bowl, and this is why Dr. Dre said we can show the NFL that we're gonna be professional. And even I heard Charlemagne on the Breakfast Club say that he didn't like that, whatever it was, what Dre said right there. And I kind of understand with Charlemagne on that because I understand, like. You ain't gotta say that we ain't gonna be professional or not professional. And let me know if I'm taking this out of context, but I believe this is what he meant. That it don't matter if we professional or unprofessional. This is, this is hip hop. This is how we come through. This is how we represent. You either gonna like it or you ain't. And that's it. 